Hi everyone, Danny Katz here with Coper Consumer Watchdog. I'm here at the Colorado State Capitol because the House just passed a resolution calling for a repair score. Well, what does that mean? Well, a repair score is something that you'd be able to see on any of the tech that you buy from laptops to phones to blenders that says how repairable the thing is. Is there access to tools and parts? Can you take it apart easily? Is there support for it, software support, for a long period of time? All of those things would make something more repairable or not. Basically, none of us walk into a store saying, I'd like to buy something that's gonna break really easily and would be very hard to fix. And so a repair score would make a really big difference for us to be able to compare apples to apples, whether things are repairable or not. So why a resolution at the Colorado State Capitol? Well, right now the Federal Trade Commission has asked for feedback uh, on how to help states uh, improve the repairability uh, on a state level. And while a repair score would be something that I'd love to see the state of Colorado do, it doesn't really make sense to do on a state level. Uh, it's technically really hard, it would be costly to administer, and frankly having 50 different states with 50 different scores would undermine the whole comparison ability for consumers and make it pretty burdensome for companies. So, the Colorado House passed a resolution this morning calling on the Federal Trade Commission to go ahead and create that national standard. It'd be a lot like a Moroni sticker, so that sticker that you see on vehicles that shows, you know, what's the miles per gallon of the vehicle, crash test ratings, and other important pieces of information like engine specifications. So by the House passing this resolution, it's almost like a super comment to the Federal Trade Commission. It's gonna to go to the Senate next, and once they pass that, then we'll hopefully get a good repair score uh, soon. Thanks.